thought a minute as the climate crisis has worsened. Celebrities like Drake, Taylor Swift, and Kylie Jenner have been shamed on social media for how often they fly their private jets as a result of the connection made linking the 1% and the climate crisis. But some experts say this criticism is counterproductive in curbing climate change. Is shaming a good solution? Let's get into it. When the pandemic kept everyone at home and halted nearly all global transportation, carbon dioxide emissions dropped 7%, which is the annual reduction rate necessary to meet the Paris Climate Agreement's goals by 2030. Many climate scientists argue that obsessing over individual action is not the best way to effectively mitigate the climate crisis. They argue that collective group action across large scales makes the difference. Experts would point to President Biden's Inflation Reduction Act as a perfect example. Renee Lertzman, a climate activist, told ABC News that because this is such a nuanced issue, people tend to hyperfixate on individual action rather than the necessary systemic change. Plus, flying on a private jet used to be, well, private, and now it's plastered all over social media. But celebrities are in a unique position to serve as a catalyst for the climate movement given their millions of followers on various platforms. Arnold Schwarzenegger, Mark Ruffalo, and Leonardo DiCaprio have used their star status to bring climate action to the forefront. Even Jane Fonda got arrested on her 82nd birthday by bringing 82 people to the Capitol to protest climate change in 2019. So being a celebrity doesn't need to be about private jets. It can also be about inspiring action.